AI becomes much more present in pretty much all of our devices and all of our daily usage, we're going to need a lot more electrical power in order to um, you know, actually use the AI. And the US is much more power constrained uh, than China. China has twice as much electrical capacity. This year, they'll build about 500 gigawatts of solar capacity, and the US will build 50. China has 30 nuclear power plants under construction. The US has zero. And you know, if um, the bottleneck on AI becomes more electric, electrical production, then China is much more ahead here. And there's a lot of top researchers working in American labs who are Chinese nationals who attended Chinese schools. And it could be that they don't like San Francisco, they don't like Donald Trump's policies on immigration, they don't like his rhetoric, and they decide to repatriate back to China. And so I feel like the US definitely has a lead in all sorts of technologies, but it's many fewer than the past. And this lead may diminish, uh, and not even in the crucial area of AI, is the US, I think, necessarily going to have the advantage forever.